I'm Gia Nicolaides. It's day 144 of the national lockdown. And if you haven't heard already, the country moves to level two of the lockdown from midnight. President Cyril Ramaphosa announced on Saturday night that the move to level two means that we can remove nearly all of the restrictions to resume economic activity across most industries. The most controversial issues have been the ban on the sale of alcohol and cigarettes. The restriction on the sale of tobacco products has now been lifted. This after two court challenges and calls from industry leaders to lift the ban as the black market has been thriving. Alcohol sales will also be allowed again. Alcohol will be permitted for on-site consumption in licensed establishments only up until 10 p.m. Liquor outlets will also be allowed to sell alcohol for off-site consumption from Monday to Thursday during the hours of 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. only. All restrictions on interprovincial travel will be lifted. Accommodation, hospitality venues and tours will be permitted according to approved protocols to ensure social distancing. Restrictions on family and social visits will also be lifted, although everyone is urged to exercise extreme caution and undertake such visits only if necessary. Current restrictions on international travel will remain in place. No gatherings of more than 50 people will be permitted. Among others, this includes funerals and religious events. Spectators will not be permitted at sporting events and the curfew will remain in place between the hours of 10 p.m. and 4 a.m. The president says restrictions have been eased because it appears that the infection rate has improved. Over 3,000 new cases have been detected in the past 24 hours, which is much lower than previous weeks. The death toll is sitting at over 11,000. The number of active cases is now just over 100,000, and the recovery rate is now 80%. Meanwhile, the US government has donated personal protective equipment worth 5.9 million rand to South Africa. The plane landed on Saturday and will be delivered to the beneficiaries of identified departments. For more on the pandemic, go to our website ewn.co.za and remember to like, share and subscribe to this YouTube channel. For more, go to ewn.co.za.